hi hello guys so like uh, our remaining uh, the stuff from this application is like whatever the data we have added on this um, multi-step application we have to show that data so we will bring that data over in the in the format of table so let's do that for that we have created a file that display data.js so let's create the function component over here and uh, let's do that so for that uh, what we have to do we have to bring the some table content so i have copied this as i have already so you can pause video and you can get this let's um, so I, because I don't want to make it lengthy so let's import multi step step context from step context and what we have to take final data as we have to iterate on final data we have to show the data from final data variable notice click uh, use context and we have to take multi step context but before that we have to add the use context from react so here so here we have to bring the table content so like uh, just i'm copying the table so till the table body i have copied this and inside this so inside this we have final data dot map is a data and inside this what we have to put the table row i'm just copying table row and inside this so inside them um, we have a unique key so key i am putting as a data dot email and here let's copy this values and let's put it over here So here what we have to do we have to replace like data dot first first name data dot last name then data dot contact data dot email data dot country data dot district data dot city data dot city then land mark data dot postcode so now here it is showing as an error oh, okay we missed to finish this one so table completed then table content so it should remove yeah like so now what we have to do we have to bind this or bring this into the component so what we will do we will have a display data from 
component and what we have to do we have to display this below to this so display data so let's check if it is coming display data you having issue 26 line number So here we have to put this in bracket expected assignment or function call and instead of some expression something is wrong here Final data so, uh, we are 20 bracket or oh, we missed like we have to put this bracket instead of this so let's now it should be let's check it out yeah so we have this table below to this but we don't want to show this if we don't have any value so let's check final data dot length is greater than zero if it is greater than zero only then we have we want to show this otherwise we don't want to show so let's check now we don't have any data for that instead of just create so that it will so let's check it out what is happening over here so let's put data j uh, contact number email India, Mumbai, Mumbai, anything we can put, landmark, temple road, then postcode, anything, let's submit it, yes. So you can see we whatever the data we have added it is showing in the here. So let's add one more data uh, like Rahul last name the contact number is I think email Rahul the red so this is a dummy data Pune, city also Pune, landmark, bank, road, postal code, is anything. So let's check it out. So now you can see as uh, we have added or we have submitted the form and then we are getting the data lines below to this table. So this is what guys we want to build uh, with the step by step. So um, I hope you have enjoyed this video. So you, uh, I'm hoping you will try this and uh, so that you, you will come to know like how we can build this app uh, with the help of context API hooks and the material UI library. So thanks for watching this. Have a good day.